I'd like to tell you a little bit more about Dr. Wareham, you sure. see. It's hard to get him flustered. I've tried repeatedly when I've been sort of not angry with him, but disappointed in something that, you know. But, um, I mean, he just seems to be, he will not respond uh, with anything but just silence or... <laughs> And, of course, I am at sort of the other end of the thing, and uh, it's always an inspiration to see him. Uh, n nothing seems to get him stirred up about anything, and uh, that's very impressive to me. So he's very easy to work with. He's not going to be yelling and screaming. I may be yelling and screaming, but he is just calm and quiet. And for a surgeon that's unique, I'm certain he won't be saying the same things about me, but he is very, you know, calm and not a hyper-reactor. Uh, well, for me, uh, I wouldn't be here if uh, Ellsworth hadn't, if his life hadn't unfolded the way that his terrific, uh, amazing influence on me. I found him to be a master, uh, going right along with what Joan was saying, not only of, of the profession, uh, but a masterful human being. Someone who cared, someone who was a gentleman, uh, above all, just never, never off the edge somewhere. It was just this, I think the word is that when you, when I was with him at least, I felt secure. I felt like maybe I could do this. And for many years, so long as I was rubbing elbows with, with Ellsworth, uh, I felt like maybe, maybe one day I could measure up. Well, I'd agree, it's, uh, I think, Start off with, as I mentioned, his skills are beyond question. I mean, it's uh, been a real inspiration to me to see his ability to handle any situation that came up, whether it's uh, something minor, something major, something under stress. I've never seen him out of control or out of stress. But I think the big thing that influenced to me is his overall ability to accept people. I came in as a young whippersnapper cardiologist and was well accepted and uh, he was always friendly, always supportive and uh, was a great inspiration to me to see how he worked under stress and to see someone who had a little idea about the kind of stress he's going through and to see his response and his total ability to remain calm and yet be effective and be functioning normally was a tremendous thing to me, and uh, he's certainly been a tremendous role model for me, and uh, been a pleasure to have been associated with him. Well, I think as you get older, and I qualify there, uh, that you're inclined not to value your opinions too highly, and um, I, I, I'm not in a position to make a statement about that. I think everybody has available to them considerable information. It's a matter of them acting upon it. There are people that have gone before they can talk to and who will be glad to talk to them. But uh, I, I don't have any advice to give anybody. <laughs> <laughs>